Thanks for joining today, Steve here. Today's talent management question is, how rigorous and disciplined is your talent promotion process within your organization? Are you guilty of these three common promotion sins? One, you're gonna promote somebody because they're a great individual producer. Hey, that mic guy, he sure can handle a boom mic well, let's make him a producer. Or the tenure trap one. Oh, Stefan, she's so good with customers. She's been here such a long time. Let, let's give her a promotion. Or the worst one, the 9-11 crisis, we need a warm body promotion. Be careful of those three leadership promotion sins because there is no correlation between a person's current performance abilities and their ability to be a great manager for your organization. Before I give you three measures to course correct these talent promotion errors, let me make a quick business case why this decision is the single most important decision for your organization. Great managers increase employee engagement, and we know employee engagement is a key link to the key performance indicators all organizations want more of. Higher profitability, higher productivity, lower absenteeism and turnover. When you get this management decision right, it increases employee engagement, which gives you more of the good stuff that you want more of. Here are three things you can start doing today to become more skilled at promoting the right people for the right reasons. Step number one, think about where your organization needs to be five years from now. What are gonna be the skills, capabilities, traits, and values that's gonna require a great manager to lead your organization? Take those skills and competencies and capabilities, codify and operationalize them into your organization today. For example, start hiring and selecting by them. Start onboarding, training, growing and developing people by them. And number three, be transparent with these criteria and make sure that everyone in the organization is clear and aware of who gets promoted and why people get promoted in the organization. That transparency process is so important to mitigating the negativity and politics that often surround when people get passed over promotion. And if I got passed over for a promotion, I can be upset about it, but I can't cry foul on the process because transparency builds trust and integrity into the talent promotion system. To learn more about this really important topic, go to my website, Free Training Stuff. You'll see a train the trainer module with extra videos, PDFs, and curriculum materials to help you guide your talent promotion process. Thanks for joining today. In the meantime, keep it simple, Keep it focused and keep it inspiring.